this video here will be about some places that you can go in this game, which is called Assassin's Creed. Um, it's based on uh, real historical characters, except for this guy over here, the main character, he's not a real person. Uh, basically, you get to go to real places in the game that do exist in real life in the Middle East area. So, right now I'm on Mazyaf right now, this is Mazyaf's castle. This castle is real, but it does not look like this. These guys are all... Historically, they're Arabic. In the modern day, we'd call them Syrians. I'll first start with Damascus here. You can, as you can see, these are all the areas you can visit in the game. Um, there is um, an area in uh, South Palestine called Arsof, but that's only a mission that you can do there. It's not an open city. So Masyaf right now in Masyaf, which is in North Syria. Damascus is the capital. Acre, Jerusalem, are in um, the Palestine area, and Kingdom is basically a land that connects all of them. So let's start with Damascus, which is the capital city of Syria. Uh, I guess I'll go with outskirts so I can actually see the city from outside. Now, at, at the end of this video, I will put a couple of pictures from real life and compare them to the game. There's Damascus. This is what it looked like a thousand years ago, or at least that's what the game says it looks like. I've been there a couple of times. But it looks like it looks something like it does right now in the modern day. over here um, I don't know I saw I saw many of these gates in uh, in real life when I was in Damascus so we it doesn't really have a specific name but this mountain here that I just came down from it's called Kasiyun in real life and it actually has a uh, satellite pole up doesn't exist in the game though alright now I'll go to um, what we call uh, Suq al Hamidiya. it's basically this over here oh god my camera is not being cooperative I had to cut the recording because my camera doesn't have a pause option but I uh, moved deeper into the city and I'm gonna show you this mosque over here it's called the, uh, in English they call it the Umayyad mosque we call it Umawi in Arabic oh. what a nice guy giving a speech I'm not gonna climb because that's not, civil, but not that's not the civilized way to do it. So I'm just gonna show you the gate and what the mosque looks like from inside. Get out of here. <laughs> okay, here's the gate. So if you actually go there, well, you can't go there right now because of what's going on. But 
this gate exactly looks the same like it does in real life. So here's the mosque from inside. It's one thing I like about this game. The, the fighting system is boring, the plot is boring, everything is boring about this game. It's just the art that I like and and how you know they put like Muslim cultures, Muslim kind of city and Acre like you go it's completely different. You see like Christians and churches and all that stuff. And Jerusalem is just a mix of both. So this here is the only significant thing about this mosque, the only way you can actually recognize it. It has a lot of art on it. Now look at the music. Very Arabic. This tower here used to exist historically, but um, in the modern day you won't see it. And this whole thing down here got expanded. They cut the trees, but these still exist. However, the trees are gone. It's much bigger over here. This whole thing is much bigger. And they got rid of this over here. Here's an overall view of the city. I know I'm not high enough to get a viewpoint on the entire city, but it should do. Alright, now I'm gonna have to cut now and like visit Jerusalem to show you only the significant areas in the city because you know I don't I haven't been to Jerusalem and I don't know what it looks like. All I know is um, that mosque with a golden thing on it. <laughs> I don't know what to call it either. And here we are in Jerusalem. He's so shy. And this is Al-Aqsa Mosque. I'm gonna put a picture of it at the end of the video. Let's scale it and see what it looks like. You can't really enter this. It's closed. So you could only climb it and look at it. So as you can see, there are, there are Arabic. There is Arabic writing, which I don't understand. So in real life, these are actually um, words from the Quran, but in here they're just gibberish. I can't read this. I, I, I can read Arabic. I can't read this. This is Arabic, however, but you know. These are not words. <laughs> so here. And our next step is Acre, which I never, which I never visited either. But anyway, I'll just show you all the Middle Eastern places you can visit. In Game. Final part in the video now. I'm gonna visit Acre, and uh, honestly, the outskirt. If you actually want to enter the city manually, there's nothing much to see. It's just a long road with trees around and um, crusader guards. So I'll go with this. I can just cl climb out of the assassin's office and like see the city. I don't know any specific areas there, like important areas, like the hospital where you have to kill this um, crazy doctor, or the castle where you have to kill William de Montferrat. But I'll just show you an overall view of the city. So this here, this here is the city under the under the Crusaders' control. So you won't see any mosques here. Just like Damascus, you won't see any churches. So Jerusalem is just between, basically, and. So I'll just sh show you a couple of scholars, churches, there you go, that's the church over there. 
that was that used to be a mosque as you can see but I guess it was hit by you know when the crusaders broke into the city and they took control of it they destroyed all the mosques in real life Dam Damascus was really a cradle of humanity still like there, there were all types of religions in the city even under the um, the control of Saladin and the Muslims so don't believe whatever bullcrap you hear about all oh, Islamic control that means oh kill all Christians that's nonsense okay now anyway this this here is a castle and um, we basically have a target to kill this is the highest viewpoint in the game you can you can actually climb over there well I'm not gonna be doing that obviously and I'll show you a couple of um, Christian scholars and look at the accent like the accent is English No. And here's the Crusader Guard. Okay, now where can I find scholars in this city? Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go somewhere where it has a church or something. These are the docks over here. That's not where I want to be. Uh, I don't know. That's kind of look like Syria from above here. If you actually look at the map. <laughs> oh, look, another crusader. I'm gonna mess around with him. What the hell you? Uh, nothing. Hey. Here's a familiar. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess I'm, we're gonna have to pass on the scholars because I couldn't find any. I think you can only find them when you're doing a mission. You can actually blend with them to enter uh, enter restricted areas and assassinate your targets so I guess that's it for our video hope you enjoyed this short comparison of real life pictures versus the game